what? But as you peruse said text, what'll smack you with a sideburns post-fucking haste is Mussolini's singular obsession with the word socialism. Socialism. This workers' party. That motherfucker's editor must have been paying him on a per-socialism basis. In fact, the first time I read this book, it was for a school assignment at age 11. Oblivious breath of fire addict that I wasn't in time. He repeated the phrase so many fucking times, I literally had to grab a dictionary and look at the fuck up myself. What becomes immediately apparent in poring over the aforementioned text is that Mussolini may have made hyperbolic statements like socialism is dead in his editorials and even his biography, but it's not because he was declaring fascism to stand in opposition to it. It's because he considered it the only true form of the fucking thing. Remember now, the Italian Socialist Party gained so much support in the lead up to World War I that as a purely placative gesture, the Italian government gave them a seat in fucking parliament, something Mussolini excoriated as a betrayal of socialist principles. The operative logic being that you can't create socialism within a capitalist system. You have to first annihilate said system to build anew from its fucking ashes. So hear this now and hear it well. Whatever he says, it's gonna be really stupid. Fascism and Nazism are not anti-socialist, and they're certainly not right fucking wing. <clears throat> they're super saiyan socialism. Deal the fuck with it. What he said was really stupid.